What's up everyone? Welcome back to Not Central. My name is Giovanni as always. Welcome back to another review. Napoli won 4 to 1 today. A big big win over Lazio at the Olimpico on the road. As always, before we start, if you please subscribe to the channel, obviously all Napoli stuff as you can see from behind me, as you can see from the title of my channel, like the video, that would always be appreciated. We're at 155, so let's get to 200 soon, guys, uh, but I really do appreciate it. So, huge, huge win. Uh, I'm a little under the weather, by the way, so if I sound a little weird, I'm sorry. Uh, that's why I didn't make a video for Benevento, uh, Napoli Benevento on Sunday as well. Um, <clears throat> but nonetheless, a 4-1 win. You know, a lot of people are saying the first half was rough. I didn't get to watch the whole first half. Um, but it's not like we didn't create chances, you know, it's just that Lazio played a lot more of their game or were able to enforce a lot more of their game than they were in the second half, because in the second half, we pretty much just shut them down besides those first three minutes or so, uh, that they, that they, um, that they really came out strong in the second half and it were, looked really dangerous. Uh, but the first goal came from De Vrij. obviously, uh, I don't, you know, Reyna could have done better, but I don't think it's all his fault. I think... Koulibaly gave him too much sp uh, too much space, whoever crossed it in. I don't even remember who crossed it in at this point. Um, and then the shot, you know, Reyna was moving one direction. He got a hand on it, and again, it went in. He seems to always get a hand on it, just not able to make the save, you know. But I'm not saying he doesn't make saves. I know a lot of people out there don't like the guy, but, uh, you know, I mean, he could have done better. But it is what it is. But Napoli was getting chances. You know, Hamsi got the post. Cajon missed a great chance that he should have scored. He just didn't get any power on it at all. Um, and I think Strakosha was able to save it. I, I'm pretty sure it's Strakosha. Um, but anyway, on to the second half was a whole different story, or just Napoli was better at, you know, dictating the game after those first couple of minutes, after they finally got that one goal. I had tweeted right away that, um, <clears throat> that Napoli can't do anything on set pieces. We had a free kick that we just wasted. Uh, and then, hey, what, no what happens? A corner kick comes, and Coley Bully scores on it. Obviously, it was, a uh, Blown open coverage on the back end, and Albiol was completely open, uh, and he shot the ball, but the keeper made the save, and then Koulibaly was there to blast it into the roof of the net. This, that was the 54th minute. We scored three goals in the next five minutes, uh, or in a five-minute span, which was crazy. So 54th minute, Koulibaly gets on the board. Two minutes later, it's Callejon, um with a great goal, um, and uh, what's it called? Uh, he was uh, got the ball in the box. It looked like he was actually going to step or like fall back or lose control of the ball, but he was able to send it in the in complete opposite direction, far post. Great finish from the guy, uh, and at least he made up for that first half shot that he should have scored, which is very good to see. And then Mertens, man, what can you say about this guy? Uh, 59th minute, you know, the ball gets pushed out to the outside of the box. Keeper's coming out to rush him. Um... And then tries to fall back, doesn't have enough time because Mertens literally just gets over there, lofts the ball, and right into the top corner, right under the bar. Uh, beautiful, beautiful goal. Kind of similar to the goal he scored against Torino uh, over jo uh, Joe Hart last year as well. Uh, but this one from completely farther range, I think a more, more beautiful goal than last year. Um, so, amazing, amazing finish. And then in the last few minutes, um, it was the 92nd minute, Jorginho got the penalty. Um, <clears throat> who won the penalty? I think it was Milik that won the penalty, or, or was it Zielinski? I think it was Zielinski, actually. And Jorginho took it very calmly, cool, calm, collected, finishes it, and it's 4-1. So, again, I guess it is a, a tale of two halves in a way, just that we made a... I didn't think we played too bad in the first half, from what I saw, but we just finished the chances better in the second half, um, obviously. And then we dictated the whole game. They didn't do anything. Basta, they made their three subs pretty early. Uh, Malinkovic, Savic didn't do much... Uh, today, honestly, I, I, he doesn't really play well against Napoli. Um, and then Basta got hurt, and they went down to 10 men, so that was tough too. But I just want to say real quick that, that this game is a definition of a mentality change and that a game of where uh, if Napoli's winning the school this year, they have to keep winning games like this because they were, win they were losing 1-0 where it looked like they were very unlucky or just not creating, uh, converting their chances. And at times, you know, in the past, I think Napoli would have just you know, settled for a draw or just came back and not really been aggressive. I, but I think just Saudis drilled it into their heads that they need to win this year. And uh, that gear, they just shifted the gear. You know, they were down 1-0. They were getting, you know, outplayed in the first two or three minutes in the second half. And then uh, all it takes is one goal, I guess, and it just turned them into a machine. And they went on to score three in five minutes and then took the game 4-1. So great, great three points from Napoli. Um, as always, guys, 
I'm going to do these reviews as much as I can. I'm just a bit busy with school and work and things like that. So just stay stay tuned. Please stay with me. Subscribe to this channel. Like I said, I'm a little sick, so my energy is not is, is a little bit down, you know. Um, so I appreciate all support, all the support, though. You guys have been great. Uh, subscribe. Like the video. Ciao. My name is Giovanni. I'm out. Parts and Alpha Sam today.